Both the JMA and the ECMWF agree that we're going into a colder period of weather. But this isn't a snowy washout. So what is it? Let's see why small weather systems will make the difference. Let's do this. JMA, 20th to the 26th of December, low pressure over southern parts of the UK, with high pressure over Scotland and northern parts of England. This is bringing temperatures around average. Scotland, at the very north of Scotland, may see slightly above average temperatures with around average rainfall. ECMWF 22nd of December to the 29th. For going for high pressure over Scotland and slack air pressure over southern parts of the country. This is bringing uh, temperatures below average for Wales, Midlands and the south of England with average temperatures for northern England, northern Ireland and most of Scotland except the east side of Scotland which could see slightly above average temperatures and it looks like to be below average rainfall. If you look at the comparison between the two models you can see that the temperatures are much the same with the JMA going for average temperatures for England, Wales and Scotland may be slightly above average temperatures for the very top of Scotland and you'd say Ireland is slightly below average and that's very much like what the ECMWF say and JMA average rainfall where ECMWF are going drier so we've got some agreement there 27th of December to the 2nd of January High pressure over the UK, low pressure to the south of the UK. This is bringing uh, temperatures 2 to 3 degrees below average. So pretty cold there with fairly dry conditions. You would say if there is any wintry weather around, there won't be a great deal because it's looking fairly dry. But anything that does fall from the sky, you would say would be wintry of snow. And you see MWF. 29th of December to the 5th of January. High pressure over the UK. This is going to bring some cold temperatures. Temperatures 2 to 3 degrees below average. And again, looking below average rainfall. So, but anything that falls from the sky is going to be wintry. Comparisons between the two. JMA and the ECMWF have got agreement there that it is looking... Two or three degrees below average and JMA is saying average rainfall where ECMWF are really saying just slightly dry condition so we've got some agreement there again. JMA this is a two week period the 3rd to the 16th of January. They've got low pressure from the south of Scotland and slack air pressure over Northern Ireland and Scotland. This is bringing temperatures about 1 to possibly 2 degrees below average with around average rainfall. ECMWF 5th of January to the 12th. High pressure located northern parts of the country with slack air pressure to the south. This is bringing below average temperatures again 1 to 2 degrees, possibly 3 degrees below average at times for England and Northern Ireland and Wales with Scotland being around average temperatures and once again below average rainfall. Again, plenty of agreement there with the temperatures and much the same on the rainfall. So the 12th of January to the 19th, high pressure is located very north of Scotland, slack air pressure over most of Scotland, Northern Ireland and England and Wales. This is bringing below average temperatures for the Midlands south with average temperatures north of the Midlands with rainfall around average. So the agreement is there. It's definitely going colder, 2 to 3 degrees below average, so we can get a lot of nighttime frosts. Since it's mainly dry, we've got to be looking for any weather fronts uh, creeping in and easterly airflow. We could get some streamers coming across from the North Sea, bringing some snow showers at times.
Well, I do hope you found that of interest to you. Definitely looks like it's going colder. I'm sure there will be some snow for some at some point and anything that does fall from the sky with the temperatures that cold will be of snow, of course. If you've enjoyed it, give me a great big thumbs up and of course do leave that comment below and if you haven't subscribed to the channel, why not? I would appreciate that. Anyway, until we meet again, look after yourselves and those you love. Be a fan. Bye for now.